Hello everyone, this is Hank. Uh, today I'm back and I'm going to talk about the Canon R6 exposure sim, how it works when you have the flash mounted and turned on. Okay, so uh, what you're looking at here is the R6 screen in manual mode and I have set the exposure, the speed, the aperture and the ISO so that uh, it is too f-stop too dark as you can see on the screen. So now I have the flash uh, mounted and turned on right now. Okay, and the way that the Canon mirrorless works different from the DSLR. So how it works is that right now without doing anything it is showing me the simulated exposure for the non-flash version. It will only show me the flash version after I press the shutter button. And then for the default 8 seconds, it will show me the simulated flash. Now if you notice, the exposure sim is grayed out. Okay, when it goes back to normal and, and, and it's in white. Now when I press it, it's grayed out and that uh, confuse a lot of people and they think that the gray out mean that it doesn't work, it's deactivated. But that is kind of an unfortunate thing that Canon does. Because everything else Canon does when it's gray out mean that it doesn't work. But in this case, Exposure Sim working just fine. It's just grayed out. Um, so what you really can tell is the lightning bolt above the shutter speed there. And then you know that it is simulated flash effect. Okay, so that's how it works. It's very different from DSLR. Now, mind you, a lot of people don't see this, and, and they say, oh, this is totally uh, not working, but but if you are one of those that are using a semi-automatic mode or even automatic mode like a P program uh, or TV or AV or even manual with auto ISO, right? Um, it will work differently now. I will explain why. I'm going to switch it to AV mode right now to show you. So in AV mode right now, okay, even with the flash turn on, as I mentioned, the mirrorless, it shows you the non-flash simulated version. And it shows you with the correct exposure because now it's in a um, semi-automatic mode. It, it shows you the correct exposure, okay? So now when I press the shutter button, um, I get the lightning bolt, exposure sim grayed out, and the exposure doesn't change at all. The reason is the simulated with flash, it assumed that it will give me the correct exposure anyway. So it shows me the exposure that doesn't change. Now that kind of gives you an idea that, that um, Expose the sim with flash is not very accurate. Right now, um, I have my um, my flash on manual, and it it doesn't really care. It it tells me that that my exposure is going to be perfect anyway with flash, which may not be the case because my flash is on manual. Okay, but without saying that, now if you use if you're using manual mode, you can tell better, especially if your exposure is not the same with what the camera thinks is right. So you can tell that it does simulate. Okay. It shows you the lightning bolt for 8 seconds default. You can change it in the manual to something different, but default is 8 seconds, and then it goes back to the non-flash version. Okay, So that's how it works. Hopefully that is... Um, clear to you and uh, help you out somewhat if you haven't figured this one out already. Um, I can't find anything like this uh, on the manual. I kind of have to find it out myself. Uh, but anyway, uh, if you haven't subscribed, I would appreciate a subscription from you and uh, a like as well. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.